Hey kids! In today's video, we will be learning about infiltration. Are you ready? Let's begin! Infiltration is a crucial process in the Earth's water cycle. It refers to the movement of water from the surface of the Earth into the ground or soil. This process is also known as groundwater recharge. Let's go for a more detailed explanation of infiltration. Precipitation It all begins with precipitation. Precipitation can be in the form of rain, snow, sleet, or hail. When this water falls from the sky, it can either flow over the surface of the land or soak into the ground. Surface Water Some of the precipitation, especially during heavy rainfall or snow melt, flows over the land surface. This water can create streams, rivers, and eventually flow into lakes and oceans. This part of the water cycle is called surface runoff. Soil and groundwater. A significant portion of the precipitation soaks into the soil. The soil acts like a sponge, absorbing the water. This is where infiltration happens. The water moves through the tiny spaces between soil particles and even deeper into the ground. The Vedo Zone The region where water moves through the soil before reaching the groundwater is called the Vedo Zone. In this zone, water can be held by soil particles and gradually seep downward. Water Table Deeper beneath the Earth's surface, there is a level called the water table. It's the point where the ground becomes saturated with water. Water that infiltrates the ground eventually reaches the water table. Groundwater Water that reaches the water table becomes part of the groundwater. Groundwater is a reservoir of water stored beneath the Earth's surface in spaces between rocks and soil particles. It's like an underground river or lake. Groundwater can move through underground aquifers, which are layers of rock or sediment that can hold and transmit water. Spring and Wells some of this groundwater can naturally flow out of the ground through springs. It can also be accessed by digging wells, which provide us with a source of fresh water for drinking, irrigation, and other purposes. Infiltration is an essential part of the water cycle because it helps recharge our underground water sources. And that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed learning about infiltration today. Take care now. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos from us, please click the subscribe button. Also, give us a like. That will help us. We thank you so much and we do hope that you enjoy our videos. See you soon.